Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Another Fat Guy Cooks. I'm your fat guy, Andy Baker, and today we are going to be making Mormon funeral potatoes, because why the fuck not? Let's go. <coughs> right, so I asked on Twitter a few days ago what, you know, I should make today because I couldn't really think of anything and I was feeling pretty lazy this week. And I've been working hard with my real job that actually pays my wages and stuff, so... Um, yeah, I couldn't really think of what to do. So, Mormon funeral potatoes. Necronut, thank you very much for suggesting hash brown casserole. Go watch Necronut on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash Necronut, I assume. If not, I'll put the correct one down in the description. Bud Dwyer, at Deadpool Actuary. Mormon funeral potatoes. That's what we're doing. So yeah, Bud Dwyer, Necronut. Thank you very much. Okay, so believe it or not, the first thing in Mormon fucking funeral potatoes is potatoes. So, you know, we need to shred up a load of potatoes. So we're just gonna put this on and then put potatoes in it. Are you, you, okay? Are you with me still? That'll do. What we're gonna do now to try and get all the moisture out of our potatoes because we want to get all the starch out and we want to get all the moisture out right so the first thing we're going to do these big boys out that because they ain't good to nobody uh, you can get that. first thing we're going to do is we're going to rinse off our potatoes and try and get as much starch out of them as possible so i have a bottle of water here for that So we're just going to massage our potatoes just to get some of the starch out. And then what we're gonna do, go like this. We're gonna get another bowl, so this is where the potatoes are gonna go when we're done. Stop it. Right, so do this the other way around. Okay, so we're gonna pack our potatoes into our potato ricer. Yeah, but because they're raw, they're not gonna go through. All it's gonna do is squeeze out all the water and then we're gonna put them in here. So, put this over here, pack potatoes in here, put them like this, and then, look at that! You ever seen a fucking bad way to do that? Me neither. And then once we've done that, we're going to bang them yeah. and then we're going to repeat that until they're all done. I'll probably cut to that bit. Big bowl of potatoes. Casserole dish. Stuff to put in here. Right. I'm not sure if this bowl is going to be big enough. First thing you need is a couple of cans of chicken soup or bacon soup or Whatever soup you want to flavour it with, really. I've got some condensed chicken soup. So this little can is basically two cans of chicken soup. So we're going to throw him in. Go on. Hey, big boy. Go on. Big boy. Oh, look at that. It's fucking disgusting looking. Where's my spoon? Eh. Hey, when I was a student, I used to eat the fuck out of this stuff. Ow! Sharp can. Ow. Bleeding. Of course I am. Big thing of sour cream. I don't know what this is, like a cup and a half, something like that. Okay. And then combine this together. <sighs> right, I'm lazy, so we're going to do this in here. Oh, mix all that together. We're then going to throw in about a cup of mozzarella. Like that. And we're also going to throw in a cup of what you Americans like to call sharp cheddar and what as English people like to call cheese. We're going to throw in a lot of onion granules because that's like putting onion in it but being lazy. 
We're going to salt him a little. And here, stay with me for this part. We're going to need a load of cornflakes, like two cups maybe. I don't know, like that many. And about a cup of butter, which I've got melting here. And I'm going to mix these around until they're nice and coated. Casserole dish. Potato mulch. Put this stuff in here until it's full, or just nearly full, which this should be about enough full. Lovely. And then guess what? Yeah, I guessed it. Cornflakes on top. <sighs> if you can't tell, this is actually Sunday. The video goes out on Sunday. Today's Sunday, the Sunday that the video goes out. That's in about, I don't know, Two hours, three hours. So if the editing seems a bit rushed and the food seems a bit rushed and I seem a bit rushed, it's because I'm in a bit of a rush. But um, yeah, that's it. So we're gonna go and throw this in the oven for, I don't know, like 40, 50 minutes at about 170, 200, something like that, or 350, I think it is in American. I'm also having a bit of a smoke today as well. So this is just making this a lot more interesting. Um, yeah, oven for a bit. I'll be back. Ta-da! Mormon funeral potatoes. Should we try them? A couple of the cornflakes might have gotten a little bit on the toasty side, but... That's only because I forgot to check on it. Um, Mmm. Mmm. Looks good. Should we try it? Let's try it. Let's try it together. Mmm. Mmm. Reminds me of cheese pie. If you're English, you probably know what that is. But, yeah, just potato and cheese and cream and, I mean, it was never, it was never not gonna be good, right? Mm. And yeah, the cornflakes are a nice little touch. The little crunch is good. I think you'd have got a better effect by just a load more cheese on top and crunching that up, but all right. Mormon funeral potatoes, hash brown casserole. It's fucking good. Another fat guy's just cooked. I need to go and edit this in like 20 minutes. Otherwise I'm not gonna have time to get it out today. But yeah, um, please like, comment and subscribe. Don't forget to throw your comments down. If you've got an idea, anything you want me to cook in the future, stick it in the comments. If you think I'm fat and you don't like that because fat people are lazy and awful, put it in the comments. If you want to come around my house and give me a little tuck job at some point, down in the comments. Thanks for watching. See you next time.